Hello everyone, welcome back for some more Let's Play Fate Grand Order. We are here to continue with some more Valentine's Day stuff, which is fun because we get to hear voice lines, we get to do um, uh, just a large variety of things that I uh, I enjoy here. It's chill, right? This is quite uh, quite a bit of a calm before the storm if we're getting, uh, you know, if we're getting on to the new Lost Belt in not too long. I did already grab this stuff today because I was able to grind at lunchtime, which is not bad. So, uh, before we begin, let's start by doing the Archer Challenge. I see. All right. So, Archers. Well, we do have a number of... I'm actually going to turn all of you guys off. Let's see here. Yeah, if I want to get get ones that are multi-hit so we can go with so you know let's just go with kill archer you're multi-hit you are multi-hit um and so we'll go with instead of that let's go with you need it more than i think others because i think the other two can get it pretty quickly so we can give that to you uh for now let's just boot you out of the party just for now. Um, so we got you and you, because you can give yourself, you guys can give yourself meter for that. You can't, but we can give you the thing to do it instead. The only problem is, of course, we won't be necessarily looping with that, right? So, hello. H okay. Um, all right. See, now, a lesser man would be like, oh, that's strange. I'm going to redo the start of this episode because, you know, that was a bit awkward. But um, I'm, I'm not a lesser man at all. In fact, I want to give you my unique personal experience of having the emulator just decide, no, I'm not going to let you do that. Okay. Okay. Well, let's try that again no idea what happened there it it was like it was like bro bro you got rid of leonidas cringe i love ray chase it's like i do too but you know these things happen so let's try that again another thing i might be able to do is use some of these shots during it so we can try that for sure yes so let's do this again let's go with yep and then we'll get... Hey, it actually saved my team, at least. That's not bad. Um, my only thought is, would we need to... Yeah, I know what I'm going to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. So let's go with... Where she be? She be here. We're going to bring in you. You're going to buff them up. And then we'll... Because then you also gain the gain back, right? Uh, we'll do... Again... Uh, these C stars starting, so we'll go C star gain, just an initial bunch of them. Default C star gain. Uh, so let's go with 20% at the start, just to, uh, 20 of them at the start. Oh, but we can't do it this way because then we can't switch you in and then give the meter, right? Because you get 80% enough. Oh, wait. You get a little bit back, so I think we might be able to do that. We might be able to still. Okay. Let's give this a shot. We'll go with order change to... We'll, we'll, we'll give them meter. Order change to get you in. You'll hopefully do at least one blue attack with your own meter gain to do that. I think... Wait a sec. Let me double check. Um... Increase, so you get, okay, I hate when they say apply random effects. I hate it. It doesn't explain. 
what it does because they're not random effects. Please, just say what they do. Uh, okay, none of that is gain meter. Uh, so, yeah. Okay, charge your own gauge. Yeah, your second one does. How much is it? At level 10, it is 50%. So you are actually good to go. So never mind, we'll bring this in. And we will not do that. Not worry about that then. We'll just put back in the inkster. Inky dinky do, where are you? And then we'll just give you the 20% with the coat here. All right. So we'll do as much as we can on these bozos. So let's, uh, let's do this. All right. I'm more the preacher of loves clicking the thing. That's me. I'm doing that. So we'll see how we do with this now. Maybe, maybe better. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so give yourself. So we do want this, right? Because this gives additional effects, NP gain up. That is good. Um, an increased attack of allies with the Blessing of Kerr. We don't need the attack up, but it is nice still, so why not? Right. We'll do this. Oh, frick, you, you don't have, you don't have max, actually, because I didn't max you out. Dang. All right, well, let's do this, then. That's not enough. Shoot. Should I withdraw? I could withdraw. Let's try this again. But 80% is the max we have with you, right? What level are you for your thing? Do I have a... Do I have a how much are you at? Oh, because you're only at level 1. Alright. Yeah, let's... Let's deal with that. I didn't think you were only at level 1. That was the wrong one anyways, but she's at 111. So yeah, we gotta fix that. We gotta fix, we gotta fix that. Hopefully it doesn't count as a battle that we won. Good. Um, yeah, let's fix that. I did get Karen to 10-10-10. Because that was a thing that I definitely uh, wanted to do. So, yeah, let's just get you a bit more. We got, we got money. That's not a problem right now. Obviously, I'm going to need more later. But I'm just going to focus on getting this one up. Just for now. Uh, we'll need money later once some more of those servants come around. Though I will say I'm not getting all the ones that people are, are wanting, you know, to get. There's only there's only two for the next Lost Belt that I really want, and thankfully they should be on the same banner. So I'm not as worried about that. Okay, that should be enough now. Alright, that should be better. God, I'm so happy they made it so you can skip that. That is some Q-O-L, baby. Okay, so... Uh, ooh. Actually. So you give 50%. Do you gain... Okay, let's see here. Um, what, how much, how much do you gain? I have the wiki up for a reason now. Because again, I need, I need numbers. Um, if we go with... Is it 50%? Uh, let's see here. Increase NP gauge. 30%. So no, that's not enough. Dang it. We lost our, our one. So let's just update the list. Hopefully you come back, because we had an idea. Now it's gone. Come on. Oh, you might also be good. You know what? Yeah, because I, I know you have enough from that. Yeah, so we'll go with you, right? We'll go with you. We'll do the thing. You're 104, which is ludicrous. Sure, for the sake of shaking things up, let's go with this. Okay. Okay. We got this. We got this. We got this. I did do a bunch of playing off screen, too, so we should have more than enough. Wait. I do need to quit because I forgot. Cause I near I nearly forgot. Don't worry. Don't worry. It was a thing I said last time. Oh, this this is cringe. Again, a lesser man would cut, but I am no lesser man. 
I am someone who is learning on the go, and I lost him again! Frick. It's fine, because what I'm doing is I'm going to be putting on the bonus, um, bonus meter ones. Really? Wow, the game's just like, sorry, you don't get any of the servants that you want to get here. Yeah, let's just, just refresh again. Come on. Come on, they gotta be here. Either one. There we go. So, yeah, let's put on in the back here. Uh, default bonus. Uh, so let's go with... And let's just get Mash and put her on with that too. Yes, good. Okay. That will do better now. Okay. This time, we do it for real. Okay. Okay. Hey, it's all about optimization, right? It's all about making sure that I'm using everything I have to my disposal. So, let's pop with this. There's not enough. Because that's not the one... Wait. That's level 10. I thought you'd have enough. Dang it. Piss off, then. Oh. Oh, this is frustrating. I mean, the, the correct thing should be I should just use my own servants to not worry about it as much, but... No. All right. Come on. Give me, give me a rush. Give me a rush again. The rush with the buster. Okay, so you have it here. You're level 10, right? And this is MLB'd, right? So that should be... So let's start with 50% meter. And how much will you get? So Karna gets... I'm doing the math here. I'm actually pulling up his page. I thought it was enough. No, he, he only gets... Oh, wait. Uh, he gets... Where is it? Uh... NP damage, buster up, star rate. Where's the skill that I'm looking at? Star rate crit damage. Yeah, w do they not have it listed as what it is on here? Are you serious? Star rate crit damage cooldown. Oh, charge it by, it's a base 25%. Okay. But you start with 20%. Okay, you are good. This one's good. Thank you, Nebeck, for having a based in red, haha, <laughs> pilled uh, version of him here. So that's good. All right. Now... We're doing it. Now it's happening. Right? It better, I swear to God. Don't you love how we've started this and done nothing so far? I do, yeah, 70%. That's still not enough! I, the math was wrong! I'm so angry. Whatever, whatever, it's fine. It's fine. Um, we'll go that on you, because you'll get enough afterwards anyways, so. And then we can do another one with you after. So we'll go, yeah, we'll go one, two, three, then you can get yours. It's, you know what, whatever, it's one extra turn. We're still going to do it. It's fine. I'm not good at math. Never been. It is what it is. Okay, and yeah, come on in, little guys. Come on, come on, boy. Oh no, they're sorry, wrong one. Come on, girl. You go, girl. Okay, actually, it might be better too, because he should do enough damage to actually kill. Uh, the servant in one hit, too, so that should be good. Okay, I kind of wish you could select Noble Phantasm if, like, he got the meter from her using it. It'd be nice if there was a way for him to still select it, even if he wasn't necessarily the one that was going to be using it, if that makes sense. Um... Because then we got it mid-battle, right? I'd really like it if that was a system, but uh, it's not, and that's fine. Alright, this. And do things. Big damage. Okay, and 
wonder if you can get the, um, like, uh, craft essences from this. You know, like, are they drops? Couldn't even tell who that was. That's Robin Hood with his hood up. Okay, so... How much can you give? Not enough, but that's fine. So, you know what, let's have... Do we want this? No. No. Um, yeah, I will pop another command spell just on... Release the command spell. We'll do it to Karna, because he can wipe them out. Right? Okay. So we'll go one, two, three. Do as much as we can. Right, continue to go through the waves. There are people who've done full clears of this. They're better than me. It's I'm brainlit. You guys know that. I don't need to explain this. Okay, and we got a couple more. Alright. Oh, that didn't even kill you in one hit. Alright. Look how many are dropped on the single place, though. Alright. There we go. 13. How much are we getting? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Yep, that was worth it. Ooh, look at all those! We get ourselves a command seal, the Asinite Witch's Command Seal. Yeah, of a certain servant turned master. Yep, there we go. That is uh, Medea's there. It bears the image of a staff of a mage from the Age of Gods who caused uh, who caused and experienced much betrayal. That's a staff? I don't see it, but go off, go off. Remove one attack up buff and one defense up on an enemy when attacking only if it's arts. That's not bad, actually. That's pretty... That's pretty good. I mean, attack up and defense up aren't super common and not the biggest problems compared to some of the ones out there, but it's that's not a bad one to just throw on someone that you'd like to use. Right? Give that to Medea herself and then it's just kind of cool. Alright, silver fruit, get. So, the nice thing is we got some lock-on valentines, which means that I can pick and choose who I want to go see. So, let's, we have to use you. That's fine with me. That is fine with me. Uh, so we got you guys. Um, yeah, because I mean, this is what I've been grinding with pretty much. So we can just stick with this. Uh, sure, let's go. What crazy lavu lavu aishteru shenanigans we do in a trying love. Who we seeing? What we doing? Mass. Uh, is that Christmas or Master? What was that? Right, we have to worry about... Oh, Chanmas. Hey, Chanmas. Oh, it's auto still. That piercing voice sounds familiar. Wahoo! Happy Valentine's Day! Hold on to your mystic code, because Nagi goes back this year with another heaping helping of love. Hang, hang on, guys. Storm's headed our way. She is the storm that is approaching. <laughs> you do have a way with words, don't you, Tanner? Yeah, I guess neither of them ever listens, huh? Ha ha ha! Not much for mutual understanding, are ya? Well, that's okay. We don't always have to understand each other to get along. Anywho! Here, Chan Miss, have some Valentine's Day chocolate! I made you an orange yet, only instead of just soaking the kumquat peel in sugar, I soaked the whole kumquat. Wow, sounds fancy. And don't worry, Lane Lane and KG. I've got enough to go around. KG? Uh, I don't mind if you call me that, but I wouldn't I wouldn't call any of the other me's that if I were you. I I mean, yeah, you're pretty chill. I don't know about the Although I don't know much about Proto Koo for personality wise, like at all. Especially not the spiky one. He's not big on emotion nor mercy. Oh, well, that explains why he looked so grumpy when I called him that. And here I thought it was because he just didn't like chocolate or something. So he already called at least one of the other me's. Lane Lane, huh? Uh, she really... She's really less like a storm and more like a walking, talking, ticking time bomb, isn't she? Eh, 
Anyway, on a different note, is it true we've got a new addition, Chadmus? And a god at that? I got curious as to what she's like, so I thought I'd come to meet her for myself. Whoa! Your hair is so beautiful, you're so dainty and petite, your skin is so smooth. Oh man, I'm experiencing all the feels right now. Uh, who is this person and why does she have no concept of personal space? Who, me? You can call me Nagiko. Nice to meet you, new bestie. Gleam! Damn, she's really not afraid of anything, is she? Uh-oh, this is bad. Karen's gonna blow her top soon. We've gotta separate them before it's too late. Slap. What? Why the hell did you slap me? I see. Nagiko, is it? Do you mind if I ask you something I've been wondering about? Sure, what's up? Who is that you're carrying? Or under your arm? If you're done, would you mind putting me down? Is this my man critical? Oh crap, I completely forgot. No, oh! That's absolutely not critical. This the lady is Kamacho. She's a gotta love too. Pretty cool, right? I bet you have a, you'll two will have a ton to talk about. Not to mention you're both super cute. It's Kama, you idiot, not Kama Cho. And why are we out here talking to them anyway? When you invited me to the new god, you said we could just stay back and observe from a distance. Oh, whoops, did I? Yeah, my bad. Flash of anger. Well, never mind. This is extremely not okay, but you know, whatever. Um, <clears throat> You must be Eros, then. I'm Kama, the god of love. This is quite a coincidence, isn't it? I never expected to run into another god of love who uses a bow and arrow around here. How fortunate that we managed to find each other. I look forward to getting to know you better. Ironically, neither of them are archers. Well, thank you. That's very kind of you to say. I'm Amor, the god of love. But please, call me Karen. Kama, was it? Then you must be the Hindu love god of love. I thought you were supposed to be male, but clearly I was wrong. Quite the adorable little thing, aren't you? Oh, that, don't worry about it. It's not important. It's not as marketable. Actually, it is. Don't worry. We'll get there later. That will... That will happen in due time. Don't worry. Don't worry. Besides, I could say the same for you. No, that is true. But then, as a pseudo-servant, I suppose your vessel's gender doesn't really matter at... Have we met somewhere before? No. It's our very first time. Are you sure? You seem very familiar somehow. At any rate, I'm not performing my godly duties right now because of reasons. So having you show up now really does feel like fate to me. <laughs> Since you're Eros, the god of erotic love. I bet you have no problem turning this place into a world positively dripping with love. Just like the way I... Even with all these goody two-shows... Wait. Just like the way I like, sorry. Even with all these goody two-shoes fighting you at every turn. <laughs> yes, that's right. I can just let this newcomer handle everything and I won't have to lift a finger. All I have to do is hole up in my room and check in on a master every now and then to see if he's ready to sink into depravity once and for all. I mean, did you see what happened with me and, uh, Sesuin? It's, yeah. It's perfect. I don't know what that was about, but I got a bad feeling about it. True. I suppose we have a lot in common. If I was, in fact, Eros. Huh? But as we are now, lust simply isn't important to us. That being said, we won't deny that it too has a place. That place just happens to be a good bit below our particular station. Mm -hmm. Still, it's been a pleasure to meet you. Why, that little... No, wait, there's something off about her. Something that shouldn't apply to any pseudo-servant. Man, you guys are just too cute for words. It should be illegal. Oh, wait, no, you both are illegal. Oh, yeah, huh? I knew I was right to force you to come here, Kama. You guys are gonna get along great. Uh, I'm not sure about that. If anything, they look almost ready to kill each other. I don't know what you're talking about. Doesn't look like anything like that to me. Nope. Seriously, kid, you don't want to get mixed up in a cat fight. They're more dangerous than a wounded bear. You better just play dumb before they remember you're there and make you pick a side. I see. As the unrivaled hunter of Ulster, you must be used to these kinds of dangerous situations. What's up, Mash? I'm sorry to interrupt your conversation, Senpai, but we found more bitter shadows. Could I ask you to go investigate as soon as I send you the location? <laughs> Roger, Dodger! Huh? Nagiko, uh, uh, thank you. A bitter shadow? I don't know what that is, but it sounds annoying. I don't need that kind of hassle, so I'll just let you guys go take care of. 
On second thought, I'll help too. After all, it should be an excellent chance for Eros there to see what I can really do. I honestly don't care whose love is baser or loftier. But the idea of this naive little twit who's never been incinerated by Shiva's third eye thinking I can't hack it just pisses me off. Plus, when I pawn off my job to her, I don't want her thinking it's because I- Oh my god! <laughs> there it is! LTG! <laughs> you should treat yourself to a valentine now. I'm not gonna say the actual words because that would get me banned off of YouTube, but you know what I'm saying. Oh my god. There he is! LTG the servant! They did that on purpose. They did they did that a hundred percent on purpose. I'm I'm telling you, Albert at Aniplex right now is giggling, going, oh, they're gonna read it. They don't know. Anyways. I don't want to think it's because I'm some low-tier god who can't clean up my own messes or anything. I'm taking a screenshot of that. I'm taking a screenshot. Okay. No, I want her to feel honored that she gets to spare me from having to sell my own hands. If I have to show off what I'm really capable of to make that happen, then fine. Oh my, that's very courageous of you. No wonder you were so famous in Indian mythology. But unfortunately... I just don't think your particular traits are going to be of much use here. What? Of course they will be. Wait right here and I'll prove it. I can easily handle some fake shadow servants by myself. Come on, you idiot. Just this once I'm going to let you help me. Huh? Weren't you just talking about how you can handle this yourself? <laughs> oh, well, no biggie to me. I'm just glad to be asked for help. They ran off before we could say anything. Maybe we ought to go after them? Why? Anyone can beat those bitter shadow things as long as they have the power of love, right? So since Kama's technically got a love too, why don't we just let her take care of it? Oh, is it going to be that erotic love does not work? What the hell? I destroyed those things a bunch of times, but they just kept reviving. Welcome back. Hmm. Where's all that looks like a cactus? Sorry, what? What do you mean a cactus? Nagiko was... It? How does she look like a cactus? What do you mean by that? What happened to her? I left her there. This god's a real piece of work too, huh? <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> save me, Chadwe, save me. God bazooka, die. Oh my god. <laughs> Literally. Nagiko. She'll be fine. That ought to do it. Thank you for gathering them all in one place like that, Nagiko. That let me purify this whole hallway with a single shot, which is much more cost-effective. Master, are we really sure this lady's a god? Are you freaking kidding me? What the hell are you doing with the bazooka? That's straight up cheating. Eros is supposed to use a bow and arrow, damn it! Love has no defined shape or form. So I see no point in sticking with a bow and arrow when the situation clearly calls for a bazooka. But I guess that may be hard to understand for a more... Old-fashioned god like yourself. <laughs> oh, so you think you're hot shit just because you beat those bitter shadow things? You can only do it because you knew the trick. I wouldn't have lost in a fair fight. Oh, then what do you propose? Let's take this to the simulator. I haven't been this pissed off in a long time. Really? I thought you were basically always pissed off. Shut it, master. Now come on, Eros. It's your last chance to apologize. Alright, I almost have no stamina and I really don't enjoy these kind of personal fights. But if you insist, then I suppose I can't refuse. This is what this is this is a good one. And it's not just because my, my, my man got a and when I say my man, please note, I think he's a terrible person. Don't take it the wrong way. Don't take it as me being like, yeah, this guy's great. No! It's just me recognizing the meme. Triggers each turn. Increase your attack at the end of the turn. That could be bad. If it wasn't for the fact I'm freaking freaking ripped, yo. I'm gonna be killing you in one thing here. It's a weird personality. Very strange. 
Wow, that didn't do it in one, huh? Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see. There we go. Okay, and let's go one, two, three. That should be probably be enough. He's just a good one to keep using. Like, at the end of the day, I feel like all the protagonists, any, if you are a protagonist character at all, you're going to be a good character. Like, they will make it so that you are strong enough to, you know, be continually good. Like, even Aris, same thing. She's just good. She's just solid. Bear witness to God's glory. God Bazooka final shot. Dang, you took that like a champ. What do you say, Kama? Shall we call today's duel a draw? <laughs> this can't be right. I might not look like it, but I'm still a god, damn it. How, that's kind of funny to say, actually. How the hell can that bazooka hurt so damn much? What the hell's it made of? That? Uh, well, yes, of course it hurts. After all, I love you. Uh, say what? What in the world are you talking about now, you crazy god? This bazooka's power is directly affected by how much love its user has in their heart. So since I love every person on Earth, every shot I fire with it hits with the force of the entire planet. And in your case, Kama, you were incinerated by Shiva, making you a being that's essentially the universe. Which means that by loving you, my god's power is equivalent to Earth and the universe combined. Are you freaking kidding me? I mean, spreading love is my job is in my job description too. So by that logic, my bone arrow should be just as powerful as your goddamn bazooka. Oh my, it's worse than I thought. I can't believe you're still ignorant of such a basic fact. Our definitions of love are different. Your love is all about building you and your loved ones up together with their consent. The very fact that you talk about providing love proves that it's very different from my kind of love. God the Father's love simply exists. Period. Oh no, is she off of biblical love? Because that's a whole barrel of fish. Those who receive it needn't agree to do so, because true love is already complete simply by virtue of existing. Wait, hang on. Are you sure you're not just making up something that sounds good to avoid giving a real answer? <laughs> huh? Why did she just collapse? Because firing that shot opened up old wounds. As I thought, scaling up and spreading my love to a whole universe really did take a lot out of me. That's why I consider today's match to be a draw. Didn't I say as much earlier? Why in the world would you push yourself that far just to beat me? Are you some kind of idiot? Since you wanted to see what I was made of, I thought it was only right that I not hold back. I swear, every single thing you say and do is just the dumbest shit imaginable. Still, love is such a pain in the ass to begin with, that I can't blame any god who exists solely for love for being a pain in the ass too. I really thought they were going to end up killing each other, but it looks like this is working out better than I expected. Because they had something in common after all. Their only real difference is their faith. I don't know why anyone would want to go around preaching about something that's as big as a pain, big of a pain as love. Uh, but since love is kind of their thing, I suppose it's no surprise it finds some common ground. <laughs> See what I tell you, Lane Lane? I knew those two would be besties. How did you recover so fast? Besides, I've been wondering. People who fall in love can pray to a god of love for romantic assistance, but who's a god of love supposed to pray to? It's a barber shop situation, you know? Two men in town. Like, you, you go to the barber who has the crappy hair, the barber who has the good hair. Well, you go to the barber with the good, with the crappy hair, because that means that the he's a better barber, because then they have to cut each other's hair, right? It's the same thing. They pray to each other. Huh. I guess you can't really say themselves, then. Exactly, KG. But now that there are two of them, all their problems should be solved. Now even Kama Cho can ask someone for help when it comes to matters of the heart. 
really? Is that, uh, is that how it works? And that is why I made sure they have a meat cute of their own. I I hate this term. I don't like it. I hate that term. Because I always thought it was a meat cute. M-E-A-T cute. And I was like, I don't want my meat to be cute. I want it to be flavorful. Put some spices on it, damn it. What do you think? Pretty clever, right? Uh, yeah, it's great, except for two tiny details. One, I don't answer anyone's prayers for romance, and two, I don't have any intention of talking about my own love life with anyone. Gotcha. I swear. You really need to quit jumping to conclusions, idiot. Especially about, that, about the kinds of things that make my hair stand on end. Oh my. I'm sorry, Kama. I had no idea you were having such a hard time with your own love life. If you ever want to talk, I'd be happy to lend you my ear. The church is always open to lambs who have lost their way after all. I said I'm not having a hard time. Don't go building churches when nobody asks you to. I'm shocked that Caldia doesn't have a church. In fact, I'm gonna say one servant probably has a cathedral for their room. And it's probably Shieldachai Saber, probably, right? I feel like they all go to his room for Sunday Mass. I was kidding, of course. Just a little goddess humor. I don't think this means you've won, Eros. We are going to settle this someday. Count on it. Uh, okay. I think I should be able to give you a rematch at some point if I wind up with literally nothing better to do. Ah, I knew this goddess rubbed me the wrong way. This, this, that was, a, that was a good one. I liked it. Because it was, it's, it's... It's silly, but it's silly in a good way, right? It's silly while also advancing the characters, which I can appreciate. All right, so we do have the pure love, which I'll be working on. But first, first, more importantly, we have some new scenes to do. Uh, so let's start by giving some chocolate here. Let's let's give it to the dudes. Let's give it to the dudes. We'll do 10 at once here. All right, who we got? Who we got? Hello? Oh! Yeah, buddy, Waver, my man! Forgot I got you. It's in the shape of a little game controller. Well, we're not in Japan, so accept this. Oh, is Waver gonna talk to me about gender, like changing gender norms in Japan? Oh, I guess he would know more about England, huh? Yeah. It's true. Oh, interesting. I guess that makes sense. Saint Valentine would come from there. Well, you are quite quiet, buddy. I'm going to turn down the music after this. I forgot to do that again. That's interesting. Never heard of that. So people give gifts anonymously there? Yeah, leave it, leave it for them. Okay, I guess, yeah. No, that, that is something I've kind of heard of. これはあくまで真っ当な人間同士が行うべきイベントだ。魔術師が匿名で届いた贈り物を使うなど、ガソリンのそばでタバコを吸うようなもの。That's <laughs> true, yeah。君もそんなプレゼントが届いたんだ。遠慮なく捨ててしまうがいい。では、チョコレートは遠慮なくいただこう。I know you're just gonna grind in a JRPG, but that's fine, buddy. What? What just happened? Huh? Me too. What? Strange. Why did... What? What was that ending? Huh? Who we got now? This is okay. Oh! Completely forgot we got you. It's gonna be a chocolate boxing glove. 
Uh, no, nah, it's okay. I'm totally ready to go. What's up? So, I'm going to the Oh, I, I do, apparently. I kind of should, should get an exercise bike. I should get an exercise bike. Oh, but no, they're talking about a real bike. Oh, our, oh, we're do oh, we're literally doing the punch out right now. Thank you for doing the sounds. Get it? Cause real sharp. He's a saber. Uh, sure. We can go faster. Wouldn't this be better if we were in, like, New York or something? Oh, God. We got a bike in this? I guess I also forget you're Santa-related. It's so funny when you get servants from other holidays for, like, Valentine's Day. It's like, it's like doing Kirby 64 Power Fusion, but with with the holidays. Uh, well, it has a snow clearing mode, so I guess we're fine. Good. Alright. Nope, now we're in the desert. His voice gives a different impression than what his dialogue is. I don't know. Oh my god, electric bikes are the best. I, I've used electric bikes the last couple years, and they are just... Yeah. You, you can just press a button and go uphill. It's the best. I feel like the voice actor isn't going as excited as I would expect. This is a beautiful area, though. Dang. Dang, that's crazy. What, what, what's a pitching? Like, like baseball? What, what are you going to do with the baseballs, bro? Oh, God, okay. Wait, I forgot he has this cool little ring on up there. Uh, well, here, for successfully completing your training for today. <laughs> it's full of anabolic steroids. Enjoy, sir! Choco. We're gonna get so- yeah, would you prefer to protein shake? It's like an episode of Hajime no Ippo, or like any of those other boxer stuff. The main character is too into the too into the grind, doesn't think about Valentine's Day. Yeah, what I'm what what do you mean by that, bro? I don't really know what you mean. マスター、少しいいだろうか。さあ、俺は以前よりマスターに渡さなくてはならないものがあると思っていた。It's going to be something incredibly silly. What's it going to be? バレンタインのチョコでその思いはより一層強い。Yeah, show me, show me. What do we got? What do we got? 今渡す時だ。サンタが渡すプレゼントは、Yeah, that's... That does make sense. 
It's easy to forget. What do we got? Did you give me a dildo? My man. Could it have been shaped like anything else? That is a hard mode shape, by the way. A championship trophy. Uh, I feel like that is a high... I feel like giving any large fist-shaped objects is incredibly not good for, you know, Valentine's Day. Just in general. Man. I'm a guy, so whatever. But to a girl... That's rough. Well, not even... Technically, not necessarily. But you know what I'm saying. Oh. Uh, boxing versus wrestling are two very diametrically opposed fighting styles. No idea how they could work like that in the ring. I mean, I guess it would look just like Tekken, really. He's, he's a little more soft-spoken than what I would have expected with his personality. Anyways, it's surprisingly heavy. マスターに渡すトロフィーだ。下手なものは渡せん。しかし、今の俺は財を持つ王でもなければ発明家のサーバントでもない。いつだか it's not just physically weighty. Hmm. Okay. Uh, might be a bit difficult. Might be a little difficult. We're we doing this? I'll take a pass, yeah. For multiple reasons. That's okay. I have more than enough. People happily parading me around. Muron, Santa Cruz toitsos a ketes and the Choten ni tats tokidan. All right. Wow. Good. It's a good thing that that happened like that. So I can. Let's go turn down the volume just a bit for the music because they are, they're a bit quieter than I would like. Let's go through. In general, I think turning the music down a bit is a good idea. Voice go up. Music go down. All right. I'll make sure to turn that back later because in combat, it's kind of the opposite that I need. Um, okay, so let's do 10 more for the guys. I love the fact that we can skip and let's see. Okay. There's, a, there's definitely one of the guys I want to see, so. Oh. Well, th this really is sudden. Another servant that I absolutely forgot I have. Oh. Is there gonna be blood everywhere? Are we gonna be... Okay. <laughs> Just ends with them making out. <laughs> that never happened. Not, yeah. Alright, 
Yeah. You okay? Is everyone Daijobu? Oh. What a random pair that were there. Biogly mean it's an, an actual bloodbath. So to my you. Yeah. So to Shika, you want I go. Most of it. So did a so done none of the go. You can eat so hot salad to a year. Keep it out. I'm failing to see how this is going to wrap around into a Valentine scene. I'm going to be super honest. Kono Jotachi ni Shazai Seneva Narmai. Oh, wait, you don't know really what Valentine's is much, huh? It is interesting that Japan, it's Saint Valentine Day, not Valentine's, right? Oh, interesting. I don't think I've ever been, I've, I don't think I've ever heard of that. Sure, yeah, that's a that's an idea. No worries with that. So Master, now, is this guy a, it is everyone's, you know, everyone should know how to cook sort of guy? Or is he a, why would I know that sort of skill guy? Because those are two very different things. Well, let's make them together. We'll go hand in hand. Making them together. I like how they just show him to show, like, you're not alone in the kitchen. You're not. This isn't super romantic. Like, everyone is here. I want it to be a giant chocolate hand. I want him to have dipped his hand in chocolate. Taken the off like the shell, and then he can, you know, give that to Ibaraki, and she's like, "Do you know how horrible of an idea that is?" I am not the target demographic for this, you know, but I wonder if there's a girl who, or maybe a guy also. Oh my god, I was making a joke, but, um, you know, I wonder if there's anyone who plays this like, oh, this is so romantic. This is, you know, look at us, we're, you know, here we are, we're doing this. Are you gonna give them to all the Oni? Oh, those are adorable. Those are really cute. Those are way too cute for what you could have made. あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ、なんか。あ
Sometimes you don't need speaking, right? You, you can glean it from that. Hello? What what? Yeah, what was that noise? Now what is it? Yeah. Oh, this one isn't voiced. So you dare to send us these sweet shape like shooting in my decapitated heads? Now practicing for the real thing, eh? I'm surprised we didn't get to hear your impression. That'd be really funny. Since you're challenging us, the leaders of the Oni, munch munch. Damn, these are good. I mean, I accept your challenge as me trying to give him doing the impression. Okay, shooting, let's go. We'll cut off Suna's head. Is what she said. What a sad misunderstanding. Hmm? Yeah. あれはあれで、なかなかに楽しいものだよ。俺にとってはあったが、加えて、全員、歌詞についてはうまかった。で、意見が一致していた。俺が作ったことを知って、全員が驚いたのも痛快だった。Especially with the cute little faces, you know. I wouldn't have thought that he made it. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy. That was nice. These are pretty good. These are pretty good. The little chocolate dagger is cute too. That's cute. Valentine's Day chocolate Oni's made. Uh, make them uh, with help from various servants. Uh, let's see, it's a superb chat set, both delicious and cute, but Ibaraki mistook them as warning to take their heads. Somehow Suna didn't mean to mind, and all he did in response was smile after all. It was something of a miracle that he'd been able to give her anything in the first place. Aw, knowing their little story. Okay, can I just say, like, the color of her hair, the color of your hair, the color of, like, your hair, the little, like, ombre to it, looks so delicious. Like, chocolate of that color would kill me. Evil dragon under the pillow? Forgot about this one. Yes, yeah, Sieg's there. Right, 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 right. The Mecha Kure. That's Toda's fishing gear. Half Red Iliad. Yeah. What's this? Who's this? From David. Milk candy modeled after Michelangelo's bust of David. Oh boy. Okay. Um. So. Let's do let's do five new here, and then after that we'll see about getting some of the other ones. Okay. We'll uh we'll 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 maybe grab the one or two that I really want to do. So let's see who we got here. Who we got? Who we got? Show me. There's way more female servants. So who do we have this time? Okay, we're at the beach. Summer servant. Oh. Oh no. I'm kind of worried where this is going to go. Let's hope it's nice and wholesome. Ilya's, Summer Ilya's wasn't bad, but then again, Summer Ilya wasn't written in a way that was going to be a problem, apparently. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Pope. Wait, was that a dream? あ、それはその、ある意味光栄ですけれど。でも、そろそろサマーハウスへ戻りましょうね。Oh, please don't tell me we're in another dream. Please don't tell me it's a dream within a dream within a dream. 
Dang, that's a rain effect. Yeah. We're doing dream in a dream in a dream, aren't we, huh? あなたも粒濡れて。こんなに凍えてしまって。大丈夫。もろとしていたわ。まるで無遊病の浮かれガラスのように。そこの廃屋で雨宿りをしましょうか。うん。服が乾くまで。ぬくもりを分かち合うの
しいのあまり上手にはできなかったわねムマのようにはまだ難しいか A dream demon Like I've never put together Is she like Len? Len from what what is what what is Len's classification? She is a um she is a, a succubus demon familiar. I mean, yeah, but her whole thing is with the dreams, right? So like that's not Wow, okay, that might actually legitimately be her trying to be like Len. Interesting. Hello? Oh, that, that is what's meant to happen. Huh. Those are cat noises. I never put that together. Wow, cool. I'm not going to be mean. Thanks, Abby. Oh, you just switch, huh? Oh, just the one, huh? All right. Uh, so... All right. Like I said, there's a couple that I definitely want to do. So the one people people kept telling me that I need to do is uh, Van Gogh's. So let's do Van Gogh's here. People say, this is one of the best. Which, knowing her voice uh, will be really funny. Let's do this. I've only heard, I've heard everyone say that this is the best one, so. Oh, you're already transformed. Okay, didn't think you'd be like this. Okay. Uh, nope. I'm not going to use this. Why do we have an Azoth dagger? Wait, what? I could never slice off a piece of you, Goey. What? <laughs> okay. Oh. How does this conversation take such a left turn? ね。生徒本気を証明するには、自称の一つもあってこそというご法的な理由を忠実にして、いつも生身と正気を削って我らサーバントを統率くださるマスター様の痛みをご法も背負いたいという決意表明に見せかけつつ、実のところマスター様に
Nice. That sounds actually that、uh, that sounds delicious. Katoite, go h o n o now, Karmono to Steva, Higoro no Kansha no Kimotini, Eo so enu akinimo. Nado to Nayanda Geku, Yasasku Kyodo Kudasata Sejo Samo Shusakuni Mazekon de Masta, a manga sashimaste. Kotabino Kaos Nitata s h i d a i <laughs> She's a I... uh, no, it's fine, really. No worries. Honto deska, they were out of this. Uh, no, I'll just take the salad and painting. Thank you. Dato, I don't know your chimonashi. They were doka, Cotirao, or Sameo. <laughs> <laughs> ah, chocolate and olive oil go surprisingly well together. Don't know about that, Chief, but all right. My to Shikono Hiva Master Samani Tote Imotare no Hito Kagai Master. So much chocolate. Kunakanjino Kari Mono. Yo, no, but for real. <laughs> go to Choshinda. <laughs> That's really good. That's really good.、Uh, but no, actually, like, it, like if, if I was eating like a, so much chocolate and someone's like, I brought you a salad, I'm like, you are now my favorite. Anyways, that was a great meal. Thanks. <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I said that before. Huh? Okay. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> What's going to happen? <laughs> What is this Delta Rune stuff? Ah! <laughs> okay. <gasps> no way! That was a freaking s e n t e n What the frick? Let's ten go. I can go all day. Somebody help! I cannot believe she said gotta go fast. <laughs> What the frick? That's wild, yo. Alright, let's read this though. Chocolate marinade attempted. Please eat me. Literally, not happening. This result of Van Gogh's abortive attempt at the ultimate self sacrifice. It's a delicious vegetable marinade that contains the delicious aroma of olives and cocoa. It's, it's kind of strange, but I get what they're going for. It's also paired with a painting, a study of the Mediterranean Sea, which evokes a sense, an e s t h e t i c sense in her spirit origin. The study even includes the holy maiden who surprised Van Gogh while she prepared the dish. Is, who, is that? Oh, it is Martha. It's just Martha chilling on the water. Uh, the, pre the presence of just a bit of madness in the whole thing really shouldn't come as a surprise from a foreigner. Yep. <laughs> that. That was one. So let's see here.、Um, we can do. We'll do we'll also do one given one to a guy. Let's see here. Diascuri. Diascuri of one each, I know.、Uh, yeah, I don't need to do that. I'm, I'm going to focus on ones that I want to give to. Nobukatsu. Okay, Nobukatsu gets one specifically. That's pretty cool. I like the ones that get multiple.、Uh, Odysseus. I'm not, I'm actually, like, again, not looking much at which ones they are. I'm just looking to see which ones we don't have. Izo.、Uh, let's see. Okay, Voyager is the one that I really want to do. So let's do Voyagers here. This is another one that I had recommended to me. Also, to hear his little Kirby boy voice. Please watch the video Nintendo put up for 
uh, Valentine's Day of Kirby learning to hug. It is actually beautiful. <laughs> Smile and strike a pose. How, how do you, you know, I was going to say, how do you know this word? But you're, if you're the Voyager, of course you're taking pictures. Of course Voyager's taking pictures. That's its whole thing. I see you taking a lot of pictures, Voyager. Nice. Aww. Two little photography bros. Yeah, Georgios. I mean, that's obvious, but... Do you like cameras in Photography Voyager? Yeah. I never even put that together. I see, you've never photographed people, at least in a way that you can see them. You don't need the expensive ones. Those are a pain in the butt. What kind of pictures did you take today? I thought you said it's a digital camera. Oh. Probably can just take them off the SD card. Oh, is the joke that it takes like a day to do it? But also you can just, yeah, you can push the button, you can view them. That's, yeah, that's Georgios. Aww. That little photo filter actually looks really good. Let's see. Oh, are we going to have a bunch? I hope we get to see a bunch. The next photo is... Oh, what is it? Aww. <laughs> they had to put food in a way that you don't see the feet. Oh. I'm counting. You, you did one too many. One too many, unless there's one in the background. What a strange trio. Hey! <laughs> Maybe this cake won't kill him this time. That's about it. I love Gordal. To be fair, like the whole thing of being like, hey, don't take my picture, and then they smile, like that's so real. Anyways, you got me, buddy. Uh, yeah, I got you a chocolate shaped like a spaceship. It's actually a chocolate shaped like the Canada arm. Because I want to remind you that Canada arm should be a Lancer servant. Honestly, an international space station servant, which is like a combining mecha, would be really cool. Now, like, that's a gift. Pictures are such... Aw, of your Kalia family. That's really cute. That is, now that's a real gift, you know? Anyways. Huh? 
タイマーで一緒にとろう。<笑> okay. No worries, little buddy. Look at that. That's really good. That's a really good one. That one feels special. Look at all of them. Oh, they have to put both of them on there, of course. Yeah, that one's. That one's. That's something special. Let's see here.、Um, these are memory fragments of his carefree daily life during the pleasurable. Uh, Lord Leisurely, swing by visit to Caldia. A collection of photos yet to be organized. Oh my god. On February 14th, 1990, the space probe Voyager 1 captured a series of images of our solar system titled The Family Portrait. Six billion kilometers from Earth, or 5.5 light hours away, at the outer orbit of Neptune, he smiled fondly at the sun, centered the familiar planets in his lens, and captured that moment as digital data on a magnetic tape. The pale blue dot upon which we live was included among them. Voyager had already taken tens of thousands of photographs by the time it was in the neighborhood of the outer planets, Jupiter and Saturn. With only a fraction of its storage capacity remaining, it overwrote previously transmitted images. Oh! However, since taking the family portrait, Voyager received no further instructions to photograph objects. Its camera was shut off permanently, conserved power for its other functions. So perhaps there's still a trace of our solar system's family data on the. Well, yeah, especially if you know how. If you know how data is deleted on. Um. On devices. Like, it's not deleted, it's just sort of、uh, overwritten or reworked. So, interesting. So, who, let's see here. Why did it flip that way? Oh, I, I, we need it the other way. Okay, so we got us, Master, Master, Me, Fu, Da Vinci, Jingle! That is, a ter that is a terrible, candid picture of my boy Munier. But hey. Oh, the bath. That's a reference to him hating the bath from、uh, from there, yeah. Okay, that's. That's、uh, Edison. Yeah, we got Mash there. That's a beautiful one. That one's really good. That one's really good. Oh, it makes me smile.、Uh, all right, guys.、Uh, we will be、uh, doing some more of this next time. Ooh, good. I can grab those here because I need those. Um, as well as the bones. Good, 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 good. Oh, wait. Exchange for item. Oh, I don't know. I don't need any of those. Will I be able to exchange them later? I will. Good. I'm not going to use them. That's more money, baby.、Um, well, at least until the challenge quest, in which case I'll be able to probably use them every turn.、Uh, sounds good. Thank you all for watching, everyone. And we'll see you next time for some more Let's Play Fate Grand Order as we continue with Valentine's Day. I sure wonder who we'll be fighting. Actually, I don't know. We'll have to see. Also, we got Berserkers or、uh, Avengers next time. Interesting, interesting. All right, guys, we'll see you then. Ciao.